Hi, welcome to my Rabbit tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to form a mass to generate the St. Mary's Act or known as the Gherkin Tower of London, uh, designed by architect Norman Foster. It has 180 meters height and 49 uh, meters uh, base diameter, 56.5 the widest part, and 26.5 diameter on the top floor. I've already uh, prepared the uh, the guidelines, so I'm just gonna switch, switch them on and hide. And also prepare the the levels. So first, uh, just go to the massing and site, and then select in place mass, and you can name it what you want. And then uh, create a reference plane. Select that. Just draw a straight line, and you could name it so you could easily find it. Just add. And then go to the north elevation. And then select the the reference plane we've created on the ground floor. Then OK that. And then just draw a straight line at the middle. And then you could form the the curve using the SP line or spline. Oh, that's a bit curved on that. You could adjust the, the points, right? I think that's close enough. Okay, and this is this is just approximate. Once you've done that, select the two lines and go to create form and just right click. After that, select the the two mass. Normally, it forms in the two halves, and then divide surface, and then select the the pattern. Close enough to the the gherkin, and then make that uh, probably twenty and twenty, just to just for the proportion. And then go to new and create a. Go to metric curtain pattern. Select that, and you could select the triangle again. So you could form the you could form the individual uh, frame now. Um, I think the the gherkins has yeah, it's, it's actually a square uh, frame or mullions. So um, to form that, uh, just add points so we could create the profile. I'll create a circle just for reference, so we could easily uh, create the the square. Make that two fifty just now, and then just create the. Delete that, and then select the, the two lines, and that could form into a frame. Now we could also uh, add the, the the glass. 
just tab it. So uh, and then just select that and select it and make it 30 mil. Um, <clears throat> maybe you could go to the plan so you could easily select the glaze. Please select. And then we could add the parameter, material parameter. Let's say glass A. I think that will be okay. Probably the uh, the the frame. You could also add the parameter. And then you could all you could just apply it on the the main model and load it in. Oh. Okay, that. And maybe just overwrite one of those that I created earlier on. Then just go to 3D, select the the mass, and you could apply the one we we created. So that's the, uh, and once you've done that, you could you could actually change. Uh, uh, you could see us another uh, color pattern, same as the the gherkin. I think just on the top level in this uh, diagonal border. So uh, you could save that, as. and I've actually created the the model a while ago as well. So I could show you the so that's gonna be. I think that's it. I uh, hope you've learned something and if you have any comments, please don't hesitate to, to add it below. Thank you.